Hi folks, Tim here again from High and Cheap Tech. Tonight we just have a little channel news, what's going on. Uh, so I had some money sitting around today, so I went ahead and got that uh, Skinomi case. There's a picture. There'll be a link on Amazon for it. Uh, you know, it's the web application case. Uh, also, you know, that's going to go on the very camera we're filming on. The uh, Axon M's camera. By far the best camera I have. Clear, sharp, focus is good. Uh, it, it, it does EIS great. It's a really good phone, but it damn sure needs screen protectors. Unfortunately, we can't put a case on it. And therefore, of course, we're stuck with the um, accidental touches, which are very easy to do. Like when you've got a phone like, say, this one. See those raised lips? makes it very difficult to accidentally when you're holding it touch the screen <laughs> that's the downside but we're still testing this phone uh, I brought it to work I love watching videos on it it's just great the speakers are fantastic it's got really good haptic feedback uh, all kinds of good things going with it, mm, nothing like Diet Coke. Uh, when I got home, uh, I was tired. I watched a couple of videos because I have to. Yeah, any reviewer I trust or anyone I subscribe to, I always watch their stuff first. Try to leave comments, and then I said, you know what? Screw it, and I laid down. I expected to wake up tomorrow morning, but it turns out I wasn't that tired. But when you're tired, folks, nothing makes you feel better than a couple hours of sleep. So, uh, what else we got? Oh, this thing. This Comica. I have not done the review on it yet. I've given them every chance. I sent them an email when I got home. And I gave them till Sunday. Right now, this, the product I currently have, is non-functional. I'm pretty sure I know how to plug in a USB port, plug in a camera, a set of headphones, and I should see the little headset icon you get uh, when you plug in, like, one of the splitters that I use with the uh, um, new G3 so I can use the uh, external mic. And the only downside of the new G G3, of course, these people were warned when I got this thing, especially considering I had to pay half up front you know, they wanted me to get it and review it. And they don't have any reviews uh, as of, like, this afternoon yet. Their first review is going to say, don't buy this. And I'm trying not to screw them. They might make a decent product. Maybe I got a bad one. They did mention these were pre-production units. In which case... He should not be on Amazon yet. But we'll see how that works. They have till Sunday, and I will do my review, which at that point will be don't buy this. It's a POS. Uh, anything else going on? Not much. Uh, I have a little bit of money left in the budget. Any kind of dongle or cable you think I should test? Comments. 
leave them in the description below, I'll order it. I have spent maybe ten, twelve, fifteen dollars. Uh, we'll see. Or maybe I'll just hold up so I can get that uh, silicon power 3D NAND 512 gig and set up a dual boot on the old Zotac here. Uh, although right now I'm going nuts. I can't even install Chromium on it. I might have to reinstall it. God, I don't want to do that. And it says it's in etc. slash er er etc. And while I understand that stuff, I I I'm not sure how to clear the cache. So if anyone can help me, that'd be fantastic. Contact. Leave a link in the description below, or contact me on Facebook with like a friend request, and then uh, we'll uh, set up a chat. Now there, that brings to mind one more thing. I know some folks who I talk to all the time on uh, Facebook Messenger. There is nothing more annoying. I know the younger generation thinks text messages be all in the... Uh, no. No. If you want to have a technical conversation or a quick conversation, don't send me 42 little blurbs where I have to pick up my phone, break off from what I'm doing, unlock it, and look at it when I'm trying to do something else. Meaning I can't do the something else. And I set the phone down, and a second later, ding. <sighs> Either write out the entire paragraph. Or simply call. I'll accept the call. We'll have a great combo. It's amazing. Human interaction versus text and a bunch of... I don't give a goddamn about... You know, all those little icons. I, I just don't. Now remember, I'm 60 years old. Uh, but I also know when I'm being interrupted time after time after time after time. If you had to send me five messages to tell me something that would have fit in one paragraph, just do one paragraph, leave out the pretty little and thumbs up. In the end. No. Either write it out, no, read it, or call. And I'll take the break because it's amazing how much no business does business by a one line text. Nobody learns technical stuff a line at a time. You know who you are. Uh, and that's about it. I have to admit, the one with the best camera is still the Axon M. The only foldable phone on Earth that works. Hi, can you say, Samsung complete failure, Huawei, hmm, they're in a release there, I wonder why. Two glass screens. 
if you must have hopeful, something none of us asked for. And so, of course, you can get yourself a seven or eight inch tablet from China for ridiculously low prices. If you must have a bigger screen, you can get LTE and some. Uh, you can get the HI9. Uh, check C. Butler's channel. He's done some reviews on it. And I believe Mike Reed also has done some. Uh, bottom line here is we don't really need a foldable phone, but the Axon M, let's not look at it as a foldable phone. Let's put it in the correct category as it sits right now. It's the most fan freaking fantastic super camera telephone with the best display. And it's a budget phone, 133 bucks on Amazon. You can folks, check the links below. Deal with it. Enjoy it. Buy one. And, uh, hopefully I'll have some other stuff tomorrow to talk about, uh, probably as late as it is tonight, I, I don't know, I was gonna edit this in, in Linux, oh, but it's late, I think I'll just take it to work and edit it in Linux and upload it from there. Let's use their Wi-Fi, considering my bosses pay me slave wages and I can get it in and I have Wi-Fi there. Alright, so uh, that's all she wrote. I don't know. I might post this up tonight. I don't know. Thanks for watching. If you found it informative, helpful, or not, thumbs down, thumbs up, click the subscribe button, and uh, click the notification bell. That's all I got. You folks have a fantastic weekend. We'll have some cool stuff tomorrow. Very cool.